Here is a driving video on the SLK 55 AMG. We're gonna drive it slowly because it's cold still. Uh, the radio works well, killing the radio because no one cares about the radio. On this car, there are heated neck warmers, there are heated seats. If I can figure out how to get these to work, there we go, beautiful. So heated seats and air scarf on your neck. In addition to that, we got, we'll check out the heat also. We'll throw this up here and we'll put on heat. Beautiful, we put the heat on high here. Uh, awesome, heat's coming out already, it's warm, which is great, and then we can adjust these, beautiful. Heat works as it's supposed to, and we'll let you know on the heated seats in a second as we drive. To shut the heat off, you just turn this knob back down, or you press the off button, sorry, that is how you shut it off. Okay, outside of that, we have the wood grain interior, we have the Desinio button on the shifter. What the Desinio button is referring to, or what the Desinio logo is referring to, is referring to the dual tone brown on brown on uh, black interior as well as the mocha exterior. So this is a custom one-off interior. And as you open this, you got two cup holders up here. Those work great. Glove box pops open flawlessly. You got a six CD changer. Uh, outside of that, you got your dash over here. It's showing 37,000. 37,000 miles. Correct. And uh, no lights on the dash. Drives awesome. Two keys. Uh, seats are in awesome condition. Everything on this car is awesome condition. All original Desinio Mocha metallic paint. Uh, now on to the specs of the car. This is one of the coolest AMG cars there are. It has a naturally aspirated 5.5 liter AMG hand-built V8 making 400 horsepower, 400 pound-feet of torque. In addition to that, the car is a rear-wheel drive car, so it, the rear end can get a little bit active. This is the smallest AMG car they made, really. This is a similar chassis to that of the uh, C55 AMG, which is also a highly desirable car. This obviously has the Vario roof uh, hydraulics for the convertible top. Those work flawlessly. Overall, one of the coolest and most well-built AMG cars. This car does not have any of the hydraulic ABC suspension to worry about, so it has good old standard shocks uh, without any oil-based or any uh, active dampening nonsense that can cost tens of thousands of dollars to fix. So this one's a super simple, real deal AMG car with custom one-off Desinio interior. You have these shift buttons on the side of the steering wheel, left and right. Left is to downshift, right is to upshift. <clears throat> really awesome car. If you want to downshift a little for them, but not too aggressively, we're still a little bit cold and you can give it some more gas. Go ahead. Turn around here? Yeah, we can turn around here. Let's just pull in here. Brakes work well, I guess, in theory. Uh, we're going to do a little turn here and we're going to come back around. Shifting. Awesome. I believe this has the bulletproof spy five speed automatic that's found in the SL55, the SL65, and every other 65 and 55 car built during this time period. Uh, really a well built transmission. There was actually one of these. There's a huge bump here. Slow down. There was one of these I was recently on Bring a Trailer. Uh, that had a supercharger, which is uh, definitely a cool modification for this car. Uh, I would not say you need it, there's plenty of power. Uh, the heated neck scarfs work well, as well as the heated seats. So I'm gonna shut those off now because it's pretty warm in here. Okay. Beautiful. Uh, there's already a top operation video in the listing, so you can review that as you need. Driving experience, how would you say it drives? Phenomenal, it's sharp, it's nimble, it handles like it's on rails. Great car, it's got all the power you need. Awesome. And we're gonna go this way and we'll, uh, we'll give you a little bit of gas on the straightaway given that we're kind of warming up a little bit. I was talking about the straightaway down there but I guess right here is fine too. Uh, the V8 really revs flawlessly and it's uh, it's the M113 engine, a variation of such engine. Uh, sounds great. Sounds great, revs great, no major issues to worry about, no turbos to worry about. Pretty much the only thing that these cars ever need are valve cover gaskets and uh, 
that's an $800 job. So pretty bulletproof engine, transmission, uh, suspension. The only uh, component that ever needs service is the uh, Vario roof operating as it's intended to at this point in time. Great, give it some gas here. Tons of power. Okay. Thank you guys for watching. We're back at the warehouse now. Bye.